the game. It's a red stick. Alright, welcome back everybody to another BNB video. Today I'm going to be doing a little something different that I've actually never done on the channel. Going through YouTube the other day, watching some Guggen Squad, watching some Whistling Diesel, watching some Flare, you know what I mean? Just doing your re daily rounds, you know what I mean? A lot of you guys watch YouTube and everything. But I came across these lures I saw on a YouTube ad. First of all, sorry about the face guys, I got face paint on me. It's part of acne and stuff like that. I got to do that just to get rid of it. Got that on face right now. Trying these out. They're from Salt Strong. I saw them on a YouTube ad. I'll pop up the YouTube ad right here. I, don't, I saw them and I was like, shit, I'll make a very good video to show you guys lures that I found on a YouTube ad. All you guys that are on YouTube right now are watching YouTube and you might have came across an ad on my video or the video before or any other video that you watched that had a lure or something cool that you wanted it to buy in the ad. And so I actually bought it and now it's time to show you guys. So I actually have not done anything with it yet. I literally just got in the mail yesterday and I'm going to unbox it. They are not sponsoring me at all. I just came across in the mail, thought it'd be a good idea. They have like a deal going on guys where you're just paying for shipping, which I think it's might be BS. I'm not really sure, but it was only like $3 for shipping on this baby. So I was like, you know what? $3, I'll probably make that back on the video. So I'm going to buy it. Let's dig in here. I haven't even, I'm, I'm kind of stoked. I haven't even, oh, I swear to God, I haven't even opened it guys at all. But it still has the bubble wrap and everything in it. I've been saving it for this video. I still got the bubble wrap in there guys, if you can hear it. On behalf of the Salt Strong family, thank you for claiming your free pack of lures. We can't wait to see you catch with them. All right guys, so this is from Salt Strong. Bang. Here is the lure right here. Look at that. Slam series, Salt Strong Insider Club. It's kind of cool to be able to actually see something that I just saw online and now it's in my hands. It's on my, it's in my fingertip and I can actually look at it, use it and test it out. I'm actually gonna be testing it out here at the house. I'm gonna be filling up some water and maybe even a bathtub. I don't even know where I'm gonna put the lure yet and I'm gonna be swimming it, show you guys the action and everything like that. But without further ado, let's crack these babies open. Smell, look, taste. No, I'm not gonna taste it. Okay, they smell just like a regular soft plastic. I wonder if these things actually work though. I'll definitely be trying these out at the coast in a future video, but basically wiggles and jiggles like every other lure should. Yeah, so I'm assuming you rig this with like a shaky head or just a Texas rig rig. Probably nothing too special. I'm actually gonna go grab my Shimano Corrado and some lures and I'm gonna actually rig this baby up and then we're gonna fill up the bathtub and I'm actually gonna show you guys how to use this baby. I'm gonna show you guys if it actually works, if it looks good, if I think it'll catch fish. I've been fishing for quite a while, so I could definitely tell you if it looks like the right action that's gonna catch some fish, that's for sure. I don't really know a whole lot about a company. Like I said, I literally just came across it on a YouTube ad and thought they'd make a badass video. So I bought them and kind of an, not really an impulse buy, but just kind of an investment into the channel. Beautiful looking little salt lure there. I'm gonna go grab my Shimano. I wanted to share this with you guys before I got started with the video, but we already got started. So got the nail guy here, pretty badass. And I also got the white tail that I shot this season. This nail guy I shot a couple of months back, June I believe it was. We got all the deer right here. This is my South Texas buck, my hill country buck that I shot a couple years ago. That's my first ever bow buck right there. And then these are all kind of coal bucks from other ranches that I shot. So total there's one, two, six, seven, eight up at the top. So eight on this wall, nine if you want to include that one. And then for my first exotic on the wall ever, I also have an axis deer, a ram, and a black buck to be put on the wall. I'm saving up money to shoulder mount it. So please make sure you give this video a big like on shoulder mounting that uh, black buck. Hope to be adding more soon. Now it's time to get back to where our regularly scheduled program was. Basically what I'm going to do here, cutting uh, this lizard off. Not the most ideal jig head, but we're gonna use this little shaky head right here. I don't, this isn't very, don't use this if you're trying to first test it out. Uh, that's all I had in my box. That's, I don't have to run downstairs and grab one. I'm gonna show you guys how to rig this some bit right here. Basically, you're gonna put it through the top and then you're gonna poke it out and then push it on, slide it on there. Boom, through the top, bang, right there. Okay, beautiful, just like that. Perfecto, Mendo. I'm gonna tie that onto my rod, my reel here. Action and everything in the water. Now, I'm gonna be using just your regular clinch knot, knot you wanna be using if you're a beginner. However, I am not a beginner. I am a pretty experienced fisherman and I'm still using this knot. It shows how reliable and quick and easy it is to tie. Done tying in and out. I basically got that tied on my Shimano Corrado 200 XG. If you guys didn't see that video, I'll leave that video up here. It's a new fishing reel I bought. I'm going to make another video about this, explaining this, how it works, how it looks, how it uses, and basically the full rundown on it. All around, pretty good reel. I've used it one time, and I really like it. It's quiet, easy, effective to use, and it's good for salt water. Use it in the bathtub and see how it works. I'm going to go fill up the bathtub right now, and we are actually going to be testing this little Slam Series Salt Wrong Lure. Let's head on over there, fellas. Fellas. Alright, here we go. 
Alright guys, so y'all probably cannot see me very well, but y'all definitely can see the lure pretty dang well. I'm gonna do two different actions on this here. We are actually using the uh rod, Boom, right there on the Shimano 66 rod. So as you guys can see right there, pretty good action for uh for just like jigging it. That will definitely get a fish's attention. If you just jig it like that, I would do the slower motion, probably in the summer times so when the fish are hotter and the fish are gonna be more towards the bottom. I mean you could probably even do this for bass and it'll get you to bite, but this is mainly for trout and kind of saltwater fishing. So I'm gonna do a straight retrieve though that was just bumping it along the bottom now i'm gonna do a straight retrieve and then i'm gonna do like almost a drill here boom now that's gonna be kind of hard to see because all right so i'm gonna straight retrieve it now and show you guys how it looks that looks really good and i was barely giving it anything and it's in a small bathtub here i mean i think this bathtub's like five feet long i mean that was barely giving it any any gas at all now if we do a full gas here hard reel and it looks even better. It gives it a little weight behind it. As you guys can see, obviously the weight behind it that it leaves, that's going to get some fish's attention. Boom. You guys can obviously see that weight behind it. That looks really freaking good and really wiggles the tail pretty well. And I can definitely see this guy catching some fish. I mean, this lure looks like it would actually smack though, guys. I can't wait to actually make a coach video with you guys. Let's do one more time just jigging it like we did. That's a pretty good, pretty good jigging action right there. This looks really good, guys. I'm, I'm very impressed with this lure. Let me know in the comments guys if you think this lure is going to absolutely slay trout and redfish down at the coast. There's also sorts of ways to fish this. Flounder, you can, I would do this for flounder, drum, all the bottom fish. Trout, I would do a straight retrieve. Or uh, my buddy actually does like a three pop trifecta. It's like this, where he pops it three times, to sit for a second, pops it three times, and then lets it sit. That jerkbait motion always gets fish to bite. I don't know what, why it does that, but that right there always gets the bat, or the trout to bite. It's just a trout though, guys. It's nothing else. Annihilate that right there, just that motion. Two, three, bang, just like that. I would recommend doing a lighter jig head and a big head that's meant for a saltwater lure like this. They're not that uh, hard to find. I mean, just a gulp uh, jig head at Academy will do the trick. Pretty pretty good looking lure though, I'm not gonna lie guys. Definitely would recommend a buy on this one. I can't really recommend too much of a buy because I haven't really actually tested it in the, the coast yet. For right now, from what I've seen, I can definitely give it a buy. But the Slam Series Salt Strong Lures, actually were looking really good in the water there. I'm actually gonna have to test them out at the coast, like I said. Let me know if you guys live at the coast. If you guys live at the coast, let me know in the comments i want to fish with you guys I want to be able to catch some fish every time i go down to the coast it always seems like i get skunk uh, probably because i don't have the best fishing spots anyways let me know down below include this video if you guys want to pick these up i'll leave them down in the link to the description and once again not sponsored i just think they I, from what i saw they look really good in the water um thank you guys for watching this being good if you want to watch the next one it's going to be up here and down here i'm actually going to leave the coast video with buddies the down south boys eric Cun. i'm gonna leave his video up here that i posted on my channel i made the whole video i did it all but he actually took me out of the water so i'm gonna leave that up here and if you guys want to watch the other video would also be down there and if you want to subscribe right here make sure you guys subscribe and always like that video like this video and another bass and bucks video thank you guys for watching